Hello learners, this video is made to explain um, how to solve numerical question on fiber technology. Fiber technology uh, basically it is related to fiber optic cable. Uh, what are fiber optic cable, uh, then how is their construction, what is working principle and what are the types of fiber optic cable that I have already explained in my previous video. The link of that video I will share in the description box. Uh, here we are going to talk about the numerical question uh, basically here uh, generally the statements are related to the calculation of acceptance angle and the uh, numerical aperture so basically uh, acceptance angle is nothing but the maximum angle that a light wave can have with respect to uh, axis of the fiber because fiber optic cable are mean to transfer the light signals only so whatever maximum angle a light wave can have with respect to the axis of fiber that is termed as acceptance angle and uh, to calculate the acceptance angle the formula is sine of theta a here theta a is considered as the acceptance angle so basically the sine theta a is equal to under root n1 square minus n2 squares or we may keep the equation as theta a is equal to sine inverse of under root n1 square minus n2 square where n1 is nothing but refractive index of the core and n2 is nothing but refractive index of cladding uh, in case of fiber optic cable, keep in mind that N1 will always be greater than N2. For a numerical aperture, it is the major with which we may calculate the intensity of light. So, numerical aperture is equal to sine of theta i. So, here whatever will be the value sine of theta i that we may consider for the calculation of numerical aperture and we have already seen sine of theta a is nothing but under root n1 square minus n2 square so by that values one may calculate the numerical aperture let's take one example to see how the calculations related to the acceptance angle and numerical aperture are done so here the statement is provided uh, calculate the numerical aperture and acceptance angle for the fiber having refractive index of 4 n1 is equal to 1.50 and refractive index of cladding n2 is equal to 1.40 so given data is n1 1.50 n2 1.40 we need to calculate theta a and n a so formula for theta a is sin inverse of under root n1 square minus n2 square so theta a is equal to sin inverse of n1 we know it is nothing but 1.50 n2 is 1.40 so 1.50 square minus 1.408 square and that will be whole under root so theta a is equal to sine inverse of under root 1.50 square minus 1.40 square so do the calculations and we'll get the value for this n1 square minus n2 square as 0.29 so theta a is equal to sine inverse of under root 0.29 if we take under root 0.29 then we will get the value 0.5385 so theta a is equal to sin inverse of 0.5385 and do the calculation you will get value for theta a as 32.58 degree as it is an angle you may have the measurement in the unit degree so this is how one may calculate the acceptance angle for uh, numerical aperture the formula is under root n1 square minus n2 square and that calculation we have already done uh, on previous slide so again here you may take the uh, 1.508 square minus 1.408 square and by doing the calculations we will get the value for numerical aperture as 0.5385 so this is how uh, the numerical aperture and acceptance angle is calculated in case of fiber optic cable. Thank you.